All right, howdy do. It's time to finish Silent Hill. Let's do it. Let's, let's uh, do it. Oh, let's do it. All right. So last time we were stuck for about two hours on the Zodiac puzzle and old grandma was snoozing. So I had to look it up because I, I, I had to look it up because it was driving me crazy. And I couldn't find any patterns, like I couldn't find, you know, it was nothing to do with like which month they appear in, it had nothing to do with which, um, I don't know, like the order they're in, like, I don't know, like a circle or something. We tried everything, but no, it was none of that. They bamboozled us good here. I'm gonna say, this was a clever one. Look at this. Okay. You see the girl? Can you see or can you not see? Oh my god, god, Karen. Okay, well, the way to solve this, as you can see, there's two, number two, there's ten. This is some spooky music, too. Just saying. This is four. Can you see it, girl? And this is it. Oh my word. Well, the solution is how are they connected? Well, th you gotta count. Apparently, they're appendages. That's that was quite clever, but also pretty bootleg. So this one's apparently two. This balance, you know, I guess it's got two. The crab has ten, because he's got, you know, eight, I guess, legs and two, you know, snappers. And so we just gotta count the... Same for these pictures, so the bull has four. The answer should be four. I, like, <laughs> overthink, like, I was overthinking this too much. I overthink this one, mm-hmm. Um... The centaur, I believe you call him a centaur. He's got six. There you go, right there. And now this one right here, right here. Mm-hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm-hmm. Okay, and this should be right. Bam, show I am. First try. <laughs> a stone of time. Yes. So yeah, that's how. But what is with this music? Jesus. That was pretty spooky though last time. Or not spooky, what am I saying? I couldn't figure that out and we're like right at the end too somewhere. I swear we're at the end. <laughs> that thing almost got me, the nurse. Huh? Oh yeah, you gotta look. They're like health, um, haunted. Oh, that's great. I like that haunted car, it's great. Okay, so we have the final uh, piece. And now we just have to make it back to the... That one puzzle thing. I don't know where the third they are though. Where do they go? Large stone with clock face design on pillar with astrology chart hanging from it. We had it last time. I guess we gotta check every door then. I feel like a smart cookie though. Last time we played, uh, I figured out that puzzle, the door puzzle. I was like, yeah, that's pretty cool. Cause the answer was alert. You know, you're supposed to use the ages of the people from youngest to old. Oh my word. And you're supposed to spell something with their first names. I thought you had to type out their entire name, or at least like the, you know, the first and last name initials, but nope, it was just the first initials. I was like, yeah, and then we figured it out and it was awesome, I failed awesome. Can we just come from here? Oh my word. You got me. 
bootleg. Don't mind those, of course. No. Is it this one? No. Or does the... I don't think the little square piece goes in here. I forgot which room it was in, though. Oh, it does. Well, I'll be. Never mind. <laughs> it just explodes, okay. <laughs> this is a key of Haggis. There's a clock with a broken face. Scientist. Yes, please. Oh, I also looked it up. And there is not a map in this place. There's a fan-made map someone made of this area, but that's about it. The word plague. Uh, I think Haggith was the giant door, if I remember correctly. One of these. That one. Thank you. <gasps> Ooh, geez. Oh. <sighs> that nurse came running at me full speed. Oh. That's kind of spooky. That one with the uh, multiple nurses in the room. Oh, we can take the elevator. That one gives me a heart attack every time. Uh, I would like to leave the elevator, please. Nobody here? Okay. I can't see. Wait, am I in the... Where am I? <laughs> Oh, why was there a random nurse here then? <laughs> That's weird. I don't have a map to this place. Why was there a random nurse? <laughs> I think we're on the first floor, so we might as well go to the second. Like there's a random nurse in the elevator place. Give me a heart attack here. I see you. I think there was two. There's one all the way over there in the darkness. It's kind of hard to see. Also, fun fact. The chat. I have this program. And it, I can, you know, test out messages. So it randomly sends, you know, like a million messages. Oh, but like, just so I can have the chat uh, appear and work. Oh. <laughs> and one of the names, as you see down oh. here, is Mr. Whiskers. I don't know if anyone's seen that show. Oh. It felt like Brandy and Mr. Oh. Whiskers or something. It was weird. It was like a cartoon. Oh. What's on their back though? It says it's like a parasite, but... I don't know. It looks like a baby. I'm guessing it's like a that slug thing that came out of... um Whatever her name is. The police officer. Thank you. This is a crest of mercury. Uh, I'll take it. Don't know what it does, but I'll take it. A ring of contract. Don't know what that is, but I'll take it. I don't think there's anything else in here. When the night falls, my lonely days are gone. Rustic, hefty looking ring of unknown material. Snake in the symbol of Mercury signifies alchemy. Isn't that like the um Hambiye? Isn't that the uh, like a symbol used in like hospitals and stuff? Or am I going crazy? Hambiye, what have you been doing? Can you hear that spooky music? <laughs> Did you miss the uh, nurses, of course? The back. <laughs> uh, okay, so I got a, r a ring and... I don't think that was a key, right? No, crest. The turd? 
I guess we're going back to the elevator then. Can go to third floor. Bye, BA. Did you have a lovely time? At your mama's booth? Looks like an altar, I wonder what they worship. Well, I'm guessing I put down this thing, no. This, no. This, no. Never mind. None of the above. Okay. What about this thing? <laughs> What's the turn is this? Oh my word. I don't know what to do here. <laughs> it was swell. Did you get fat? <laughs> I don't know what this is supposed to be though. It's kinda weird. Alright, I guess I'm leaving. Uh, back to the first floor? I'll go back to the second. I don't know if there's anything we can still find here. V8, it's been really cold. So I'm wearing this thing. It's real cold. Pure. Pure cold. Also, I did the thing that puzzle. Pure bootleg. <laughs> Like I had to look it up because I couldn't figure out what was, you know, the solution. And it was to count, I think I told you, it was to count the appendages, I guess that's what it's called. I don't know what to do here. It was to count the appendages of, like the thing that was being pictured. So if it was like a person, then the answer was four, you know, for like two arms and two legs. It was bootleg. <laughs> we were trying to figure it out, you know, like all... I don't know. <laughs> trying to... I think we were overthinking it, of course. Uh, I think I came from there, right? I still have a, what do you call it? I still have a screwdriver. So I'm guessing I can do something with that. Oh. <laughs> I also put the what do you call it I found this little box thing when we solved that puzzle that thing right there like that, that blue looking thing and it flinged out a key the key of Haggis or whatever it's called and so I opened the door to the elevator so we got that that's about it now I'm trying to figure out what to do. Who are you? I am alive, BA! Alive! I had a lovely snooze. I feel like a bubble. <laughs> you know, it feels like I finally snoozed at a normal time, of course. I finished editing that, you know, derpy... Um, what is that game called? Monkey Ball? Like a guide, I guess. For anyone who, you know, is having trouble in levels. I put together all the attempts and stuff. Yeah, I've just been chilling here. On schedule. <laughs> of course. 
Oh, you watched the entire thing? Did you see BA? Like, did you see how, um, bootleg? Like, the first, what was it, like, five or six worlds? You can finish in two seconds. And then everything after that was, like, the more, you know, difficult levels. But yeah, it was just putting all of them together. I don't know, I thought it was kind of fun to do. The light to the future, and then there's Jade. The light illuminating the darkness. Oh, we got booty cheeks. Booty cheeks. <laughs> Well, that's pretty cool. I'm glad you liked it. It wasn't really like a, you know, it was just all the highlights, I guess, put together. And like the last ones, like I said, some of them took like an hour to do, you know, like to finish. I was like, Jesus. Like I was surprised how much I had to like remove. <laughs> But what have you been doing, BA, since the last time you were here? Uh, and also, would you like to be of assistance? <laughs> Where the turret am I supposed to go? <laughs> Do you want them to hear you? My. My. Do you want them to hear you? BA's here. The chatting with BA. Hi there. <laughs> I just ass in Silent Hill. It's <laughs> quite a name. Okay, how does ass? Since you've played this game, do you know? Um. Oh, wait a second. I may have found something new. Oh, wait, no, are those just bullets? A camera? The third? I'm trying to figure out where to go. <laughs> well, welcome back to stream. What have you been doing? Camera with flash. What do I do with... I don't remember any of these items. <laughs> this is weird. But yeah, these are the items that I recently found. I got the screwdriver, I got the camera, I got this ring, this amulet, and then this crest thingy. Also, BA, I got all the uh, UFO locations. So, all we have to do is finish the game, of course. And then we get the UFO ending. <sighs> I just have to, you know, actually figure out what to do. Get out of here, get. Also, fun fact, get, I say. Get, oh my word. Get, fun fact, I was showing Pep in Silent Hill 2, there's a get. In Silent Hill 2, there's a dog ending. And I was showing him that. <sighs> he thought it was really funny. Lacro! What is that? Some kind of fancy drink? I think I'm close to the ending. A steel plate is screwed to the wall. Oh, you know what that means. Just gonna take it off. Yeah! I think we're close. Oh, there's something in the wall. There's a key. Electricity is flowing to the key. I'll get shocked if I grab it now. I guess I have to turn the power off or something? Or do I have anything? I don't think I can do anything with this. But what is that, BA? Girl. What does C-R-O-I-X mean? C-R-O-I-X I 
guess. B A said he's drinking that. Carbonated water? Fancy sounding carbonated water? He said La Croix. Hold on, let me pause. I'll put you louder. Question. <laughs> to be uh, something else. Of course, I'm asking for like French. La crotch. Which ones you wear? It's a la crotch. Girl, it's a la crotch. B.A. Guess what? Grandma's. <laughs> Grandma's been asking for more photos of Susie over here. <laughs> also, also get get these ba. Grandma's got this fat Poogs, right? His name is Poogs, and apparently, one of her teachers has a female Poogs. And you know what her name is? Is Gertie. <laughs> the old lady name. Gertie. <laughs> Gertie. I swear there's no basement. Like, I have to turn the power off. Gertie. Wait, did you see a picture? She wants more pictures. Yeah, she demands new ones. She's seen all the old ones apparently. I'm not surprised. Oh. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Oh my lord, you watch Cat in the Hat? Oh my word. The live action one? It's pretty bootleg. <laughs> I remember watching it in the toddler days. It's so good. It's boo like it's so cheesy and like apparently it ruined the guy's career. And then the person, the wife of Dr. Seuss, or whoever the third she was, um said you can't make any more movies <laughs> of Dr. Seuss, like books or anything after that. That was Love Guru? No, I think that one was also just as bad. like a bootleg version of the Grinch and then when I like the Grinch the live action one fun fact if you've seen it the when the Grinch is a baby I tell the old hag she looks like that sometimes <laughs> mm -hmm, with those triple chins <laughs> okay girl where do I can you assist me please I am in the place and it's just called Nowhere. I may need some assistance, ma'am. Um, the last thing I did, I unscrewed... 
or I use the screwdriver. That was the last thing I did. And I don't know where the turd... Well, this place is called Nowhere. And... Yeah, the last thing I used was the screwdriver. I don't know what to do after that. I don't know what these... Huh? I don't know what the third these are either. It's weird looking panels. I don't think I can do anything here. Also, fun fact, VA, I figured out a way to um watch, you know, movies easier. Or at least record them so the audio isn't heard from the movie. And so that way because I was, when we watched it, I always like adjust the volume just in case. But now it should be easier, hopefully. You know, because I can't record the audio. Eh. Well, no, I have the screwdriver, I just used it. But what do you do after that? Mm -hmm. like, what do you do after that? No, I unscrewed the thing and the key is electric. And now I don't know what to do after that. Well, it's electric. He said he'd, you know, die if he picked it up. Well, where is I? <laughs> Oh well, no, what are you, what are you reading? Like, what are you skipping? Well, you're skipping some stuff and I'm like, oh, what, oh. Oh, yeah. Wait, where's the generator? Because <sighs> normally they're in like the basement or something, but there's no basement in this place. And I don't have a map. So I'm really lost. <laughs> And I don't think there's a fourth floor. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's like 50 million doors. I think I have that. I have a camera, I have a ring, I have an amulet, and then I have a crest. Uh, to get to the key, uh, to get the key of Vessor, go to the room next to the kitchen and open the bag of jelly beans. The key will fall out onto the floor. Wait, where's the kitchen? You don't fucking know.
You've never seen me wear a jacket. It's real cold. Yeah, like which floor? Uh, it should be the bottommost one because it says it's right across the hall from the basement door. So we'll go there, I guess. Okay, hold on. I know where that is. If I. Well, I've never seen the kitchen or generator room yet, but hold on, I'm trying to find the basement again. I was just there. Is it, um, because there was three keys or three doors with a label on it. I got the Haggith one. I got the, I forget what it was called. The other one, and then one of them starts with a P. I don't have the key to that one, so maybe. Okay, here's the basement. And there's a wall. <laughs> like going straight, it's just a wall. Here's just another like room place. And then if I keep going this way, it's just more room. Oh my god, that is so comfy there. Did I come from here? Yeah, I did. Yeah, pl Plelig, P H A L E G. Pleleg? I don't know. And then there's also uh, this bird cage. I can't open. It's got a key in. It's on a door. It says this door is locked and it has that word written on it. And then there's also a bird cage with a key inside and I can't open that. Okay, I don't know where that is yet then. Uh, hold on. <gasps> Jesus Christ. Wait, how do you do that though? Like without giving the answer, like how are you supposed to... Because you're probably seeing a picture of it. Do you see what it looks like? It's got like those weird, it's like three tiles, two doors, and then like buttons. No. I'm just reading. Just paragraph. Oh, it's on the No. Wait, so the room contains two paintings beside an altar. Yeah. What are you supposed to do there? I don't want to. Yeah, I got scared. That Those nurses in that room always get me. I, you know, it's all quiet and then they just come out of nowhere. They spook me. Is there a caption? No. It's oh, just. Oh, yeah. Something light and then darkness. Okay. I don't know if you're looking at the stream. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Don't. 
flash of the camera. Don't. Oh my god, hold on, you don't ruin it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, stop! <laughs> but thanks for the answer. <laughs> I don't even remember this at all. Oh shit. The light to the future, alright, I'll take a picture of that. I don't know what that means, but I'm guessing that's the pattern. I don't remember this at all, like this entire section, aside from those nurses there, is like a blank in my brain. Thanks, babe. Doink. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I don't, like, I would have never thought of that. <laughs> to use the... thing. There we go, we opened that one. I'm gonna take a picture of this one. I got scared a few times in this game. Maybe like at least three or four times. <laughs> a random like, you know, moment like that. You know, I guess like a tiny jump scare, I would say. <laughs> got me a few times. <laughs> All right, girl, you can close out of that for now, and then you can come over here and join us in the chat. I don't want you. Come on, Neil. No, we no lot. Maybe you can be in the chat and ask him. There's a botanical reference book. Don't need to read it now. Uh, you smell, so he probably doesn't. He, he's got you muted. There's only health in that place? That was weird. Oh, oh my god. Gonna meet you. There you go, that's better. Okay. This is the birdcage key. It's a weird shaped key. Alrighty then, we're back on the pass. Yeah, it makes it so much harder without a map. It's so bootleg. Also, what's my health? Yellow? I'll use a health thing. You hear that music too? Like how weird it sounds. I'm gonna put save, just in case we don't get bootleg. I think my speedrun strats, of course, I'm not. I'm at like what eight hours now, eight something. I wish it showed me, like my previous save, because I think I over like wrote it. You know, like the save. And so it's not saved. I want to know what my time was on that one. I don't remember. Uh, was it here? Not today, nurses. Was it here? Excuse me, bird. Can I open your cage, please? Key of Pollog. Yes. Thanks, girl. Wait, what the third? Oh my lord, it's these things again. Except there's shadows now? What's the third? So you can barely even see them. And they still do like damage to you and whatnot. They're so bootleg. Oh, here's the kitchen. There's something in the thing. In that door over there. Or cabinet. The chain is missing a link. Come on now. There's a dagger of milk. 
Melchior? Uh, what is that? <laughs> the ancient dagger named after the Magi? 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 Jesus Christ. <laughs> Heal me! <laughs> What was that? <laughs> what was that? I just... I guess I'm not supposed to take that. Oh my lord. Girl, did you see that? They boot like this. I took a sword thing. It was like... I kept the cabinet closed. I'm trying to walk away and this tentacle creature just pulls me by the leg and then I die. I'm like, what the turd? Yeah, I don't... I guess I'm not supposed to do that. <laughs> Do I have the camera though? Or do I have to get all that again? Ah, uh, bootleg! I have everything except the camera, I think. Oh my word. We got bootlegged. <laughs> that spooked me, that, like, that sound. I'm like, what the turd? I thought it was a boss or something. You better save the game, right as you said that. <laughs> Right, as you said that, I got bootleg. Oh my word. Uh, I think it was on the second floor somewhere, if I remember. I think the camera was here somewhere. Nope. I'm just gonna leave the sword in there, of course. Was it here? It wasn't the... Oh no, the camera was like... In some room, like on a table if I remember correctly. I think... Wait. Girl. Was the camera on the second floor or third? Yee. Well, I did, and I just told you the tentacle thing came out of nowhere and killed me. So I lost that. I like cuts, lost that. Came out of nowhere and just. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I'm asking for the sea scenes, is it life and death? Life and death. And you know what her answer was? Not my problem. <laughs> life and death right here. God, oh. I found it. No thanks to you. Oh. God. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm watching videos. And, um. Making fun of Karan. God, Karan. Yeah. That's you. That's not you. Only sometimes you're. Well, you know. Apparently the name is given to those uh, crazy old hags They like have a heart attack if you've probably seen them They've got oh my word They've got like these you know recognizable haircuts of course um, They're like the middle-aged you know Soccer moms and they're, like, they're those those kind of people that you know I'm gonna talk to your manager Let me speak to your manager right now and then they have a heart attack, of course, about every little thing. Right. I'm gonna listen to your words, though. And I'm gonna save, of course. <laughs> that was pure bootleg. I don't remember that. 
I th I'm guessing the second half or like this section like completely like it's gone erased in my brain I don't remember it at all that was so bootleg oh my word fun fact in Resident Evil 2 I think on the PlayStation 1 uh, there's a similar thing I didn't play the PlayStation 1 version I played the remake with Pep and there's a thing where there's like this, you know, you're just walking down a sewer or something and then this giant alligator comes out of nowhere and it's like a one hit kill. If you die then you get put back to, you know, where you started from. Oh my lord. Nope. <laughs> uh, nope. Pep did it on his first try, it was magical. Oh jeez, 8 hours and 33 minutes. <laughs> Not my best time. Well so far, that's how long we've been playing so far. Grandma's asking for Susie photos. I think B8, we lost him. I think we lost him. <laughs> I think you scared him off with your singing girl. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. Fun fact. Uh, I hope Fatal Frame comes to the Switch too. Like maybe a port of Fatal Frame 5 would be pretty cool. We finished the first one on the stream and then I hear the second one is the best in the series. I haven't played that one yet. Came out on the PlayStation 2 and then was also remade on the um... What do you call it? On the... Hold on. On the Wii? Girl? Calm it down, ma'am! And only in Japan, and so fans actually had to translate it, like fan translations, which is pretty cool. Thank you. I think that was it. That was the only thing in this room. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> Put save. There we go. Or not save, but the pictures. Uh, there we go, just like that. And then ta da! Alright, let's try this again. These little turds are gonna try to come for the kill. You gotta take him out, of course. Or I guess the key is first, right? Yeah. Oh, the girl. I saw Chippy T, the police boss. Yeah. Did you watch it that far or no? In Squeegee's Mansion? The ghost? Police, Grandma Jesus! No, leaf. Oh my word, she deaf. She, she deaf. She deaf. She pure deaf. You smell. But I showed Shifty T that. He thought it was funny. I'm like Shifty T, that's you, pure flip. All right, thank you for the key. I'm gonna press it again, of course. Just in case we die. I don't wanna lose our progress. <laughs> thank you. 
No word. No girl. None of that, okay? That was back in my <laughs> Meme. Call me Dean. Uh we opened the pelic door, right? Yeah. Alright. Wait, I can't see. Yeah, these little turds are ghosts now, for some reason. Look at this. Me back! Hi, BA. BA, these little ghost turds from the school are back, and now they're invisible. <sighs> Luckily, I saved. Also, you missed it, BA. We got killed by this giant tentacle creature. Is Jakub your name? Yep, that's my name. My name is Jakub. <laughs> that's my name. The jumping dudes? No, the from the school, if you remember. The guys with the knives that took me out. We couldn't, you know, get through the school because of them. The ones that made those derpy sounds. Jakub is him, he is Jakub. <laughs> They is me. The bootleggers, yeah. Look at them trying to stab me. I'm gonna hit him with a hammer. Also, BA, Grandma demands Susie photos. <laughs> right now. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm gonna show you though, hold on, if I don't die. Let me show you some BA. Look at this. You missed it. Get out of the way. Because they make funny noises. Yeah. BA, are you looking at this? Look at this. The chain is missing a link. There's a dagger of Melchior. Take it. Yes. Are you ready for this? Uh. Where is it? A tool used in road construction to create holes. In the road for poles. Look at that. You pull it out and you get eaten by a tentacle squid thing. That gave me a heart attack. I didn't save and then I like I jumped and then they killed me. <laughs> Girl, you know what BA said? She needs to ask personally, not through a third party. Hoof! <laughs> Says she's too lazy. Holy cow! Yep. Did you just die to show me that? I'm honored. I sure did. We saved, so it's okay, but yeah. It was so bootleg. And I don't think there's anything else in here except that, so I don't think I'm supposed to take that. You know? I equipped it too, but. Wait, girl, can you check? Girl, this... Okay. It's locked. The word Beth Horror is on the door. Becca, baby. This Susie. <laughs> Icon on Twitch. Becca, sir. This reminds me of the prisons. Oh, we got a cutscene. <laughs> Cheryl? Cheryl? The floors and walls are covered with graffiti. There's an ank. How do you say that? Ank? A N K H? Swing away, Jakku. I'm trying my best. Um. But girl, can you check? 
I don't think that sword does anything else except it's a booby trap. But yeah, I died just to show you, BA. I was like, I gotta show you. It was bootleg. You gotta see. What is that? Jelly beans, do you want to open the bag? Yeah, I want jelly beans. Oh my god, Harry. Just dropping jelly beans all over the floor. Curl, he j it just exploded on the ground. Were you supposed to do that or was I supposed to keep them? Oh, there's a key. <laughs> I'm like, who puts a key in the jelly beans? What if I ate that? What is this? Oh, we're back at the like TV room. I wonder if we, cause I still have the tape. I don't know if um, if it shows something different this time. If you remember, BA. Oh, it does. Still has an unusually high fever. Eyes don't open. Getting a pulse, but just barely breathing. Who is that though? Her skin is all charred. Even when I change the bandages, the blood and pus just start oozing through. Why? What is keeping that child alive? I can't stand it any longer. You think that's Elisa? I won't tell a soul. Promise. So oh, please. Oh, she. Whoa. Well, I'll be. Huh. Spooky BA, spooky. But yeah, these things can eat my butthole. But yeah, um, how does AS? What's your name? My name is Jakub. How do you do? You've been here, of course, a few times now. When since we've been playing this, you can introduce yourself too. Tell us your name. Do I have any more health? I have that one. I don't know if I want to use it right now, but... No! I remember this room, though. Yeah, we're really close to the final boss. Like, we're really, 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 really close. I think pretty much on the other side of this room, or door, is the final boss, but I don't think we can get there right now. Like we shouldn't. A child's drawings are scattered on the floor. Yeah, it's locked. Thou possess them to guard thy spirit, evoke five rites, unveil they f thy fate. In the sewers part, I uploaded it. I have it all uploaded. The sewers were fine. It's just that school section, six, maybe seven, must be a kid about that age. That school section was pure bootleg. Your name is Humbert? Humbert? I've never heard of that name. Well, it's nice to meet you, Humbert. Use the Ankt. Ank How do you say that? Ank? Girl, you know on, like, Boob cancer. Support boob cancer. You, you know that symbol, right? Or like Egyptian symbol? What is that? How do you say that? A N A N A N K H Yeah. Oh, you know what I mean. I think we're supposed to put the sword there, but how do I... The chain. It says something about the chain is, um... Ink? Okay. But girl! We got a Humbert in the chat here. Yeah. Is that kind of like Hubert? The word 
Aretron is carved on the door. Yeah. Um, but no, the sewer was fine. It just, I was low on health. You know, I was low on health in the sewer section. So I had to go really slowly. Oh geez, I'm low on health again here. I had to go really slowly. Just so I don't die. So we have to take out the thing. I'm trying to think. I have a key, right? Yeah. Oh! I'm not using my brain. We can put the ring in between the link or like the chain and I think we close it. That's my guess. I'm gonna go do that. I hope I don't die though. <laughs> We're really low on health. But yeah, welcome to the stream. Do you say the M or is the M silent? Like to say your name. Oh my word, we got the leg. Game over. But um, the sewer thing, get this. They were like these bootleg looking, um, these alien things crawling from the ceiling. They were like these green alien things. And every time I walked, I had one health. They, j they, you know, if you walk past them and you don't see them, they hit you and it's one hit kill. So I had to slowly with my gun, you know, shoot them one at a time. It's a Latin name. Maybe that's why you've never heard of it. That's pretty cool. Oh my word. I should probably kill these things. Um, but I don't think they'll die. I think they keep coming back. I can try to take them out. Oh my word. <laughs> Is it a common name though? Where you are from or no? Oh, it saved my thing. It kept my items on the wall. But yeah, pretty much the final boss is right against that door, I think. Like, I remember this room. You know, like, I remember this room. Alright, if my plan works, we should survive this, like... Aha! I knew it. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Ring of con Contact? Final boss? Not yet, BA. Dagger of Melchior. So bootleg. <laughs> the chain is fixed with the ring. So bootleg. That one got me. Give me a heart attack. That was so bootleg. Use the key of Beth Hall. Hi there, Cheek56. Welcome back to the stream. Oh, we can turn the power off. Let's do it. The generator is working. Do you want to press the switch? Yes. Welcome back to the stream. How do you do? We're fin. We're gonna finish the game today. We're really close. But these things keep attacking me. Yeah. Get us a. And I want to make sure I have all the items first before I go back. Thanks for the welcome. I'm good. You. What does that mean though? Everyone says I'm good. That doesn't give me any answers. I want details. Juicy details. What have you been doing on this lovely day? Or since you've been here? I want them details. <laughs> uh, we already looked at the cassette. But, in case it's important to something, I'll skip it. Can I skip it? Yes, you can. Okay. 
Just in case it, I don't know, affects your ending or something. I don't think it does, but you know, you know. You poop today a lot? Oh, jeez. What kind were they? The hemorrhoids are killing me. <sighs> I recommend some cream stuff. Maybe it'll help. <laughs> Oh my word, get out of here. Do you have a favorite kind of turd? Uh, okay, I've been here. I, mean, I need to go the other side. Without dying. You know what, I'll be back. I'll be back. My favorite is pure diarrhea because it goes, you know, right through in two seconds. Okay. Yeah, Your favorite kind of turd. I'm telling you, mine. I've been on. I've. I've been on my toilets, you know. I've, my fair share of toilets. Okay. I've had this. Uh, what do you call it? I've had this. I've thought about this quite a lot. Okay. <sighs> my favorite, like I said, pure diarrhea. Let me tell you why. Okay. It goes right through in two seconds. You can clean in two seconds and you're out. And it feels real nice, like you're floating on air afterwards. But actually get into the toilet, that's the worst part though. <laughs> it feels like you're gonna explode. That's the worst part. I'll admit. <laughs> uh, I turned the electricity off, so I sh should be able to get the... What do you call it? The key now. Let's go find that key without dying. Oh, these things are here too? Oh my word. Ugh, they're moving now. You have one toilet and six people? Oh jeez. How many times you clogged that toilet? <laughs> Fun fact. This old hag here. She was here visiting. And get this, she clogged the pooper last time she was here. Uh-huh. You clogged it. Yeah, and then Phil wanted to go, and he's like, oh my god. <laughs> it was pure beauty. I was laughing here. I was like, <laughs> clogged? Yeah, clogged the pooper. Just uh, like, even I don't clog it that much, and I'm like, girl, how did you do that? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Girl, you clogged it twice, girl. The first time I had to go and save you. Girl, I took a giant turd today. A lot of toilet paper. Nothing. I'm a clean booty, and there's no cloggage. I think you got giant dookies. That's, that's not my... Pure... <laughs> I think... What, what were they called? BA dumplings? Giant dumplings. Damn. Mm, I had to save her because she was like, oh my god. Oh, get this, PA. You ready? Let me tell the full story. I gotta tell the full story, okay? So, she's over there taking off her, you know, beauty stuff. Just like, oh my god, I'm so beautiful. I gotta take off. Oh no, you're brushing your tooths. I guess maybe doing both, but brushing her tooths. I bring in the camera, just, you know, just, I don't know, just for fun. I'm like, hey, how's it going? And as I walk in there, glance at my eye i'm like oh gee she forgot she forgot to flush the toilet there's some dookie and they're just floating along i'm like oh and i'm like all right this is the perfect plan i'm just recording you know i'm recording her face and i'm like girl I'm like yeah girl did you forget something like what girl i gotta use the toilet you forgot something and she's like what she's like all calm she looks at the toilet she has a heart attack she's like oh my god get out get out She's pushing me out, and I'm like, hey, 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 cut on tape. Peel dookie, and they're just floating along. And then I'm like, hey, hey, cut on tape. And then five minutes later, I hear a knock. Like, Yakub, like, yeah. I'm like, girl, what is it? Yak, Yakub. I'm like, girl, did you clog the toilet? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, oh my word, girl, do you need me to go in there? No! 
Like, how do I unclog it? I'm like, girl, there's a plunger right there, but I recommend using the toilet cleaner. It's a, you know, uh, fun fact, a trick here. Or toilet scrub or whatever it's called. That's what I use. It's pure. It works. You just, you just gotta go in there and just, you don't stop. You just... Because the plunger, if it splashes back, you don't want to splash. Ooh. Those are nightmares. You need showers, like five showers. I know from experience, of course. You don't want that splash back right in your eye. You know, it's like, oh my lord, I got dookie in my eye. You don't want that. But yeah, she's like, maybe. I'm like, girl, open the door. I'm going to say, you know, I'm going to save you. She's like, no. <laughs> splash back is refreshing, though. Yeah, but now when it's, you know, when it's got pee, -pee in there. What? What, girl? Because it's, yeah, it's funny. Don't. Don't awaken someone in me. <laughs> The best, best kind of water. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm like, poop poop. <sighs> I need a heal. <laughs> um, but yeah. She, she had trouble, you know, unclogging the pooper, so I had to get in there, you know. I'm like, alright, girl, I'm going in. I flush, I'm like, girl, it's already unclogged. You did it. Did it. She sat on the pooper. She didn't want me to open the thing. I'm like, all right, go. Just take this. Just hold it, okay? And just unclog. And whatever you do, don't stop. Just go. You gotta go full force. If the water goes up, it's like, keep going. It's you versus the timer. <laughs> but once, if it overclogs, you know, once it overflows, that's when you gotta stop. Your all hope is lost. Start taking the towels. Putting it around the door because you don't want it to start spilling everywhere. I know that from experience. Um, that, those were the worst. Those were the worst. Girl. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you gotta be careful. Sometimes, sometimes depending on your door, you know, if you're not, you know, quick enough, the water can go under the door. Little turds can go under there too, you know, just sliding down the stairs like, oh gee whiz, somebody clogged the toilet. Somebody clogged the toilet. And it wasn't me. Because I know how to unclog it. Because I've done that so many times. <laughs> uh, yeah. Twice. <laughs> you clogged the pooper twice, and I've maybe done it once. And we've been here like two years, girl. You've done it twice. You've been here like four weeks. Telling you, I, she she just she says it's a bottomless pit, but you know it goes in, but it's got to come out too. It's just <laughs> it's like an elephant. I'm like, oh my god, Jesus! And she comes back and is all stanky. What was it? You, I don't hear your farts. You got no, pills. You got pure st no, I hear them out when you're out. You pure stinkers just I'm like, oh girl, Shifty had a big boy today. Sounded like he ripped his pants, girl. I was like, Jesus, Pam. I'm like, oh my god. Pam. Pam, what was that? Uh Hold on, what am I doing? I'm trying to think. If we do. <laughs> I'm trying to think. What am I? Oh, the electric key. Girl, electric key was on the second floor. <sighs> oh, bless you. But yeah, it was. I was like, oh my god, girl, spray it in here, cause you know. <sighs> it smells. But it's okay, mine are I'm, I'm...
They nasty girl. Like she's trying to kill me. Yeah, she's trying to kill me here. They like, pure like right in my face. I'm like like knockout, you know, just like I fall over. We play. What? Oh yeah, I don't think you were here, BA. We played with Shippy T. The um don't or keep talking and nobody explodes. And Pap and I were you know pure focused because oh my word, you okay, girl? Drink some water, ma'am. It's the drugs. <laughs> Jesus Christ! You stop the smoke and you sound like my neighbor. <laughs> But, um, we're playing the don't or keep talking and nobody ex. You okay over there? <laughs> Go get some fresh aqua. She's dying over here. She died. Oh, speak to me. We were playing that game, so Pep and I, we were pure focused, you know, because in that game you have to be full speed and like. You know, make sure you don't mess up and all that good stuff. And, you know, Grandma's watching because we were taking turns. And she's watching. We're doing that. You know, Pep and I, we're just, I'm telling you, we're just staring. We're like, okay, we got to finish this in time. And then out of nowhere in the background, all you hear is just... I'm like, what was that? I couldn't stop laughing for like five minutes. It's recorded, of course. Caught on tape. Somewhere, I don't know which part it is, but it's the one where we're playing all three of us. And she just interrupts with a blast. I'm like, oh my god. Uh, uh, MJ, yeah. Yeah, it caught me off guard, okay? I was not prepared. Dude, Jesus Christ. Yeah, it was a part. Girl. Where's the key again? Is it the sec? <laughs> Useless. Is it the? Was it the second floor? Oh, girl, there's nothing here. The electric key. Yeah, you can. Yes, it is. You scroll down and it's on the left. I did. It's not in the cave section. The categories? Oh. Yes, sir. It's hard, babe. Should be. I'm going in circles now. Girl. Oh, where's the key? Did you find it? Was it on there or no? Oh my god. I'm looking at one of the thumbnails for our videos and it looks like your hands are just in front of the peaks. Where else would they be? Like my lamps are spilling out at the sides. Where else would that be? <laughs> Thanks. Oh, <it's> Carl. <laughs> Carl. Wait, are, is it on there or no? Uh, not the fart, no. Well, no, the... And not the thing with Pep, either. No, the <laughs> playlist. Is the playlist on there? Uh. Oh, you click on the playlist and then you'll find it there. <laughs> You have to remind me then, so I can... I don't know why it's not there. It should be on there. Oh, my word. Okay, I'm going to the... Second floor? Am I there? Or... Girls, remind me. Why is the elevator not working? I have to go up. I think, right? 
I think. For the key, the electricity key. Can I get a confirmation, ma'am? Where's the key? That like electric one where you had to turn the generator off? Was it the second floor? Well, duh, but I'm not gonna lie, which one is that? Okay. Wait, which floor? Which floor? Oh! oh I need, like, I need a 100% answer. <laughs> Elevator doesn't work, what the truth? I can't even switch floors anymore, so. But what is going on right now? What is going on? What is going on? Girl, oh, I'm asking for assistance, ma'am. The key, where you're supposed to turn off the generator. <laughs> Did you check your butt? Maybe. Your butt out of the checkboard. The thing, the electric key. I hate this. There's a game called Rule of Roses. I hated that game. The entire game was nothing but doors. And like, I beat it, but it was also a horror game. I didn't like it. And this is reminding me of that game right now. <laughs> but the electric key. I don't know what it was called. And for some reason I can't... Oh! I'm being derpy. I can't take the elevator because the elevator is, you know, offline. <laughs> I'm bootlegging. So it has to be here then. Hmm? Yeah, where... Which, like, hall was it, does it say? You're being a herp, McDerp. Yeah, I get it from grandma over there. Yeah. Does it have anything to do with the game? That has nothing... That has nothing to do with the game. I'm like... Which one of these? I don't know what it's called, but the electric key. Uh, yeah, well, yeah, but where is it though? Like which floor or like which room? Like, but. Tell me anything. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> drugs. The drugs kicking in. Mm-hmm. 
Look. The what? I don't know what that means. I don't know that. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is so bootleg. Then how? How are you supposed to do that? Cause I can't take the elevators to get up there. Oh, aren't you on the second floor already? I think I'm on the first one. Like, is the first one? Yeah, I did all that stuff. But you gotta turn the electricity off, right? Yeah. Was it the one with the P door? The plea, whatever it's called. Yeah. <laughs> Look at his feet. Because <laughs> I'm right by the door. Yeah. Yeah, that's the first floor, so you gotta go up a floor. Yeah, so then how do you do that? Because you can't get the key if the electricity is on, but. I don't know. I'm, oh. You can't get the key if the electricity's on because you get electrocuted. But you can't use the elevators to get to the second floor if it's turned off. Excuse me. So, wow, can you like place check, please? Cause I gotta turn it back on then. And I don't think there's. You're being a creepy sneaker. I don't think there's any stairs. Eat booty cheeks! They killed me, girl. <laughs> girl, they killed me. Darn. I was gonna carry the gun because I think that's the last thing we need too. Like I think that key because we have the sword and then we need one more item and then we open the final boss door. I'm just gonna shoot them to the emptiness until it stops. Okay. This is pure bootleg. There's one called Oh yeah, Eritron, okay. Um This is the room. Okay, they did, so that's nice. Here's that room with all the weird doodles and whatnot. I don't think there's anything here. Yep. You just made that up. Oh, I didn't watch that video. I don't think I watched that video.
<laughs> BA sent a picture of you in the chat. An icon. <laughs> it's you, girl. Yeah. <laughs> Do you see it? Right down here. An old grandma. <laughs> oh, girl, girl, <clears throat> girl, girl, the girl, the new icon, girl, you gotta, him, 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 the schlong, girl, him. No, remember schlong, him. <clears throat> the dong, girl, put the dong. Oh my god. We're, she, she, she's a little derpy. She's <laughs> a, little, a little rusty here. Yeah, put it in the chat, girl. No, it's not. I don't know what the pair that is. <laughs> you gotta type it in there. Oh my gosh, it's so light. <laughs> Don't be racist to the uh, pumpkin boys. I like the pumpkin boys. <laughs> oh, cause he doesn't know about it. No, it's just, I think it's just Dong. Dong. You're living in the past, man. Halloween was like five days ago. And you have uh, Christmas trees up. That's not until like another, what, 50 something days or 40 something days? B.A. you cray cray. What do you do this time? Oh my god, what kind? Oh my Jesus, girl, you don't need that. Girl, you don't need that in your life. Girl, you don't need that in your life. <laughs> but it's so good. But it's so good. <laughs> but it's so good. Where is this door? Like this is so bootleg. Girl. Okay. Two seconds. I'm looking up a fan-made map. Hold on. I can't take this anymore. Hold on. I'll be right. Back. All right, I found a fan-made map. Gonna use this thing, figure out where the turd we are. Cause this place is confusing. I have to find out where I am right now though. This is the, I think this is the Grim Reaper's room, right? Is that what it's called? I think so. Okay, this is the morgue. I believe, if I'm correct. Ooh, there's a shower just for you, B.A. Um, blah, 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 blah. That's the third floor. Now looking for the third. Oh, morgue, diary. Hold on. The Hall of Opal. Where is the key? This door is locked off, so if you are getting the key of Aaron, be sure to unlock this door before you turn off the elevator. Oh, thank you. <laughs> um, 
morgue is here. How do I get to that door? Two seconds, everyone. I think I go left. Okay. Then I go here. Uh oh. Uh. It should be over there. If I go straight that way. Oh my god, you gutless turds. I just made it there. I think we have all the doors open, so I can turn off the electricity. I'm gonna do that. But yeah, BA! We're gonna finish this game. Um, I'm guessing you're at your place of work, yeah? That's my guess. Okay, we got this. Here we go. Uh, oh my lord, why'd they come back? They're supposed to be dead. Oh, there's only one left. Okay. Woo. Um, I'm looking for the generator room. Which I think was up here. No. But yeah, if you find the turkey boy, that would be, you know, something to look at. Generator stopped. Yeah, turn the elevator generator off. All right. Then you can show me. All right, pause. Where am I? Generators here, go here. Someone say turkey? <laughs> okay, and then I turn. I was saying, do you have like an icon? Or I can try to look one up or something? Oh my word. Um, but I don't know if you're in work. We're about to finish this game. I just need to make it to that key over there without dying from these gutless turds. My grandma fell asleep. Um, I turned that off right. Yeah, then I'm going back. Grandma conked out, but... She's asleep, yeah, conked out. I conked out for like 30 minutes too, on the table here, <laughs> at like 6 o'clock. Oh, they did. Oh, they did. Him in the face. Woo! Okay, the key should be here. Yes! Why did that take so long? Yes! 30 minutes? 30 minutes what? Pause. 
pause. Okay, now we gotta make it back to We should probably save. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's save. <laughs> but what thirty minutes? <gasps> Six. I want to see how much damage does this thing do on these bootleg creatures. But if you have a way to watch, BA, I wouldn't mind watching that bootleg, you know, Thanksgiving thing after we finish this. It's probably like 30 minutes, like the other one was. Uh, which way do I go again? I came out of here, right? I think I go here. That's not one hit kill. I'm not gonna force you, it's okay. the Christmas one or what was it Halloween that was weird I think it was just a time period or something like the way they talked was weird I was like what the turd but like I said I think it was like back in the day that's how they spoke the people old folks back in your day Kick him while he's down. Jesus, man. Why would give me a heart attack? <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Now I have to make it downstairs or to that basement. We're alive! Ooh. I'm really low on health though, but... Oh my word, there's a guy right there. <laughs> Alright, but save. It should be right to the left of me. Alright, BA. <laughs> I wouldn't mind though, if you have a way to watch it. I don't mind taking a yonder. Alright, uh, the door of whatever it's called should be here. Alright, here we go. Bootleg. We put safe, so that's fine. I think we have to make it all the way to the end. There's a room. We have to open that, get the last item, and then right to the final boss. I think, unless they bamboozle me, I know that's the final boss, like, 100%. Like, I remember that room, I swear, I remember that room. Just using the sound. <laughs> Take them all out. Alright, here we go, here we go. Everything is going according to plan, sheltered in the womb. 
What the hell? But it's not done yet. Half the soul is lost. That is why the seed lies dormant. <laughs> Who's this voice? What soul remains captured in that husk? Are they ghosts? Buried deep down in the subconscious. Are you trying to say it won't work? That wasn't our agreement. No, no, these are just stalling tactics. If we lend a hand, we will be able to get power. Ultimate Never fear. Power. The promise shall not be broken. Are you ready, PA? UFO ending? But the power we could draw now will be very weak. This guy's got Almost a weird nothing. voice. <laughs> Unless we get the other half of the soul. We'll use a magical spell. Feeling this child's pain, it's sure to come. But that will take time. I don't remember this cutscene at all. Like, please give me health. <sighs> I need health. You're not paying attention. Uh, dar disc of Ouroboros. Alyssa. All right, Alyssa. Let's do this. I don't have any health, so we gotta wing the boss. Here we go, ladies and tears. I think it's the final boss time. You never got the UFO ending? Yeah, we got all the stuff. I'm gonna put save. Here we go. Yep. Eight hours, 49 minutes. Alright. Use the disc of Ouroboros. Here we go. Come, come At least I think it's the final boss. No, I don't want to. I think it is. I think. Do what mommy tells you now. You're not my mother. I just want you to lend me a teeny bit of your power. That's all. You're no. not my mother. I don't want to do it. So that's Cheryl. It will make everyone happy, and it's for your own good too. Oh, At least. But mommy, I just want to be with you. We named her Cheryl. Her real name's just Elisa. Two of us. Or Elisa. Understand? Fun fact. Oh yes, I see. Maybe mommy has been wrong. Yes, you're crazy. Mommy. Why didn't I see this before? There's no reason to wait. Herein lies the mother's womb, containing the power to create life. I could have done it all myself. Mommy? I don't... I, where am I? This isn't the final boss. Where am I? <laughs> Um, so yeah, I think from what I remember what they're trying to do in this game is trying to get this lady to grow like Satan in her stomach, you know, poop out Satan, <laughs> I think. Oh, there's the final boss. Here we go. The talisman of Metrotron was being used. In spite of the lost soul returning at last. Just How did she get here? Would have been for naught. <laughs> Sybil, how did she get here? It's all because of that man. That man. We must be thankful to him. Get the hype in the chat. Even though Alessa has been stopped, his little girl has to go. What a pity. <laughs> oh. Freeze! <laughs> what in the devil's name? So yeah, if you didn't save her, I don't oh, think you would have gotten that cutscene. Well, well, well. To think you'd make it this far. Where's Cheryl? What Where's have you done to her? What are you talking about? She's still you not wearing any slippers. Times restored to her former self. No mood for jokes. Don't you see? She's right there. 
That's absurd. You are the only one who thinks so. Why? Why are you doing this? It's been a long seven years. Yeah, I don't, For the seven years since that terrible day. I don't remember much of this. So I'm trying to listen. Lisa has been kept alive. Suffering a fate worse than death. <laughs> Stop that crazy lady, Jakku. Alessa has been trapped in an endless nightmare from which she never awakens. He has been nurtured by that nightmare. Okay, so yeah, I was right. She's trying to grow. To be born. She used her daughter. Like that day has finally come. And I guess trying to grow Satan the time or something. Is nigh. Everyone will be released from pain and suffering. <laughs> I like how they're just standing there. There's no Our salvation is at hand. <laughs> they're just standing there. <laughs> the day of reckoning. When all our sorrows will be washed away. <laughs> Almost like they're frozen or something. When we return to the true paradise. My daughter will be the mother of God. God. Was it Satan? I know it was this weird looking thing. Like... Yeah, I don't know what the third, but... Final boss, ladies and turds. Cray -cray. All right, I'm not gonna take any chance. Samael, yeah, I'm not gonna take any chances. <laughs> I have one hit and I'm dead. Look at my health. I'm going full sniper here. A rifle. Ah, oh, got me. Bootleg. <laughs> Bootlegged. <laughs> It's okay. Luckily, I don't think we have to watch that again, right? Hopefully. Do we have to watch that cutscene again? I think I can just skip. Oh, no. Okay, I'll just skip. Okay. So, yeah, this is why you need the rifle. Because if you walk up to Samael over there... Um... I don't think... Does she hit you from any direction? Oh, no, you're fine if you just keep running. If you walk up to Samael, yeah, you see how there's the shield that you can't use melee weapon, melee weapons at all. And I think the rifle was the strongest one. I swear, I thought it was one hit, but I guess I'm wrong. You know, we have very limited ammo, though. I think we have like 12 bullets or something. I wish on the uh, this gun. So we really have to, you know, you can't miss even once. I think. But I don't know if, I don't know if that's enough though. Oh, we have 42. Never mind. Okay. I remember, I remember it being very limited when I played. Oh, <laughs> this is going to be bootleg, ladies and turds. <laughs> this is going to be a little bootleg. We don't have, uh, we don't have that much health. <laughs> Give me, give me a few moments here, okay? Just, just give me a few moments. But yeah, we're finally at the final boss. We're here. We have all the weapons unlocked. We're gonna get the UFO ending once I defeat this, you know, god, of course. If I can zigzag. I think I have to zigzag because it like predicts your thing. I don't know. Yeah, my health is... I'm one hit from dying. It's all those little, like, the... Whatever you call them. Those ghost dudes with the knives. <laughs> uh... 
Zig dag circle, zig dag, zig dag, zig dag, zig dag. Oh my word. I need a better tactic. I'm gonna try just circling. See if that works. <laughs> um, this is what you're supposed to be, you know. I'm supposed to kill the boss in one try. <laughs> it's, I'm, I'm not doing a very good job. But yeah. Uh, oh, did I miss? Circle, 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 circle. Bootleg. You're gonna see that. <laughs> you're gonna see this for a while. Is it like normally when you play and you have health? Um. Does it take one hit to kill you or no? Or does it take multiple hits? Okay, I have another idea. I'm gonna try doing the uh, the jump, backwards jump, kind of how they showed in that intro. Shoot her six times, or whatever it's supposed to be. Oh, come on. It didn't do it. I think you're supposed to. Um... <laughs> this is gonna take a while. Give me a moment here, okay? Just, just give me, give me a few seconds. But yeah, we pretty much did it. We're like, you know, this is it. This is the last thing, and then we beat the game. I don't remember, like, I completely forgot how long Silent Hill was. Because the entire ending. Go back, go back. I guess I can't do it with the rifle. Like I can't do the jump backwards with the rifle or something. <laughs> this is bootleg. This is bootleg. <laughs> and I don't have any health, so. If anyone has any strategies, Feel free to share. I already beat this like a hundred years ago, so I don't mind. <laughs> Does anyone have any? <laughs> oh, this is so bootleg. And I don't think I don't think there was any health packs either. I think I got them all. I just got bootlegged at the end. Run, run. What the turd? Come on, man. I think that's the strongest gun too, right? Like, I think you have to use that. Zigzag, 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 zigzag. Come on. I put save right before that cutscene too. I don't think there's any health. Like, I, cause I can still make it to the um, hospital if I load. And then just come back here, but I don't think there's any health pack. Someone can check. Two seconds. I'm gonna check because I don't think we're gonna beat this if I just keep doing this. <laughs> Hold on everyone, I'll be right back. Alright, um... I don't know. I looked it up. And, like, there's probably a thing, you know, health pack locations, but I couldn't find anything. 
Like, I think I got everything in the hospital. I think I got all of the health packs I could and I wasted them all. <laughs> like, I have enough bullets, but I don't have enough health. And every time, um... She uses the thing, I get electrocuted, you see? And it's one hit kill. We finally made it to the boss and I get bootlegged. I'm gonna load. We're gonna explore. We gotta explore the room or like the place. It's the only way. <laughs> like. I don't know. Like. I think I got everything. So we might be bootlegged. Unless I can do the impossible, of course. Which some people. I saw a video that said, you know, no damage taken. I don't know how, but apparently it's possible to beat the final boss without losing damage. But I don't know if I'm a professional, okay? I'll be honest here. I don't know if I'm a professional. Um, but yeah, that's what's happening here. I'm just looking if I can find anything. Like one health thing or something. Anywhere <laughs> on the ground or anything. I don't think so, but... Because this makes it a lot harder. <laughs> this quit a situation you're in. Yup. And this place doesn't have any root or like, what do you call it? A map. So it's kind of hard to tell where you've been. Nothing here seems to be, you know, can't pick anything here. Bootleg. I think the only way is to wing it. Like pure, you know, wing it. Because <laughs> I can't go outside either, I don't think. Like, I'm stuck in this place, and I believe I checked every room. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think we have a choice. I don't think we have a choice. Um, there's that one hallway. Maybe... Like, I didn't see anything there. But this one right here. Maybe there's something here I can find. Apparently, in the Japanese version of the game, I think there's supposed to be like an article here or something. You can read about Elisa. Yeah, there's nothing. I can't open the door. <laughs> I mean, if anything, I can at least equip, you know, that. That's about it. <laughs> Bootleg. Bootleg, BA. Bootleg, I wanna beat the game. Can someone check? Is there like, is there some speedrun track, like speedrun strats? <laughs> zigzag. It's so hard to zigzag too, cause Ooh. the tank controls. Come on now. We're so close to the ending. <laughs> like we're right there. Z 
Zig zag, zig zag, zig zag, zig zag. It's just like monkey ball all over again. We're gonna be here for a while. Oh. Or can someone check? Does it say anywhere? Like how many hits does it take with the rifle? To take out the final boss or no? I thought it was a one hit kill. Like I remember my pal. I mean I could be wrong but... I remember something like that. Like it took a few hits. Like one or something with the rifle. I guess I'm wrong, but I think I also had plenty of health too to beat the boss. I think I'm playing a new new game mode or whatever it's called, New Fear. Destroy the controller? No. Just a little I don't think so. I know my brother has. <laughs> my brother has um, destroyed controllers before. You know, we were playing on the original oh. Xbox. Uh, Torak Evolution and Jesse Radio Future multiplayer. We grew up on those games. And my brother, whenever he got angry or he lost or something, he would just throw the controller on the ground and just destroy it. And it was pure bootleg because, um, the controller doesn't, you know, it costs like a hundred dollars. Well, not a hundred, but you know what I mean. It wasn't cheap, of course. That and then the batteries. Like, we had the wired controllers, and so you can just plug it in and you don't need batteries. But after he destroyed, you know, all of them, we had to use the ones with the battery. And so, yeah. It was bootleg. Oh my lord. Oh. In the arms of an angel Hey me 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 In the arms of an angel mm -hmm. oh. Oh. Two seconds. Since All right, I looked some stuff up and there's a glitch apparently if you enter the boss without any bullets, like zero, <laughs> the boss automatically dies. I guess the devs put that in there intention intentionally. Last resort. Also, uh, someone wrote on the thing. What do you call it? You can either do that. You can either try to get health and ammo. I have no health here. And then enter the fight and run in circles using the strap. Run combo to avoid this. Hoping you'll survive long enough to make it to the end. Running in circles. I need to practice this. I don't know what it means. Running in circles with L1 and R2. And then the third one is you can restart the game and try again. <laughs> Come on, that was... We can do this, I believe. I believe. I gotta practice. Running in circles. It's not a circle. Ooh. 
this out of circle. I Just like that. No. <laughs> Maybe like that? Nope, that doesn't do anything. What's the turd? Using Straff and Run combo to avoid lightning. I don't know what you mean by that. Like, I want to actually beat the boss. I don't want to bootleg it. Darn. We might have to though. I don't want to replay it. <laughs> we might have to do that. Will Jacob survive? <laughs> Find out next time on Dragon Ball. <laughs> I can't even survive one electric thing though. That's a thing. Hi Richard. I made it to the final boss and we're being bootlegged. I don't have any health. And I keep getting electrocuted. Circle or not. Hot Richter, what have you been doing? Eat my turd. Zigzag, 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 zigzag. Um, silent heal. PS one. Final boss health. I want to see how much health it takes. It's very easy on easy and normal mode, but very difficult on hard mode. She just pushed the analog stick in the two o'clock position and smashed the run button. Where's Cheryl? What have you done to her? Wait, two o'clock? What are you talking about? Smashed the run button? You've seen her many times restored to her former self. No mood for jokes. Don't you see? She's right there. Yeah, I don't want to bootleg it. That's good. You had another power cut out? Bootleg. That was fun. What's been happening with you? Well, we're trying to beat this game. I was just looking some stuff online. And as you can see, I guess I'm playing hard mode. I don't know. I don't think I am, but I guess new, you know, new fear mode or whatever it's called is hard mode. Oh. Oh. 
I'm trying to figure out how do you um this is the final boss. I'm trying to figure out how to generator now third time this year that's bootleg what happened to the other ones <laughs> okay i think we have to bootleg it i'll try it one more time all right so this is our like 50 millionth time trying to kill this boss. You shoot it with rifles. And for some reason, I cannot survive the electricity, as you can see. Um, I have no health. I'm being bootlegged. <laughs> and like, I really, it would be so cool if I survive and bamboozle it. You know, it'd be so nice. But there's a glitch apparently, an intended glitch that devs put. And that is to um, go in the battle without any ammo. And that feels like cheating though. <laughs> it's like an intended thing the devs put, I guess. Because the only other option is either, you know, bootleg it, try to survive. <laughs> but as you can see, it's kind of difficult. Or restart the game. <laughs> and I keep getting electrocuted. Like, I really want to defeat the boss. Like, I want to, you know, do it how you're supposed to. But we might not be able to. And I don't feel like replaying the game. I bootlegged it, ladies and turds. I had health, I had everything, and I bootlegged it. Because of those little turds. Darn. Well, I never tried it, so we might as well give it a swirl. I don't think you can throw away the ammo either. I think you have to uh, use it all, which is kind of bootleg. Look at how much ammo I have. <laughs> We're gonna be here for a while. <laughs> Darn. So yeah, apparently you gotta get rid of everything. If you had the plasma gun, or whatever it's called, from the UFO ending, this wouldn't work because I guess that you know weapon is uh, unlimited or something maybe I'll try it on my own trying to take out the boss without you know doing this on my you know own time or whatever but yeah. I'm just reading. I'm reading like um, people are saying that they missed the rifle and they boot like that and yeah, that they had to restart the game. I don't want to restart the game. So, oh, I've never seen this animation though. Oh, is it a, uh, hold on, two seconds. Let me fix the audio. Alright, it is returned. Audio was being weird. We wasted the pistol bullets, we wasted the uh, shotgun ones. And I think the only thing left is the sniper. Darn! <laughs> I was really looking forward to taking out the boss. But, I mean, at least we, you know, we can piss this out. You know? I didn't even know this existed until now. This is so bootleg. And the thing that's kind of, you know, cheesy and ironic is that some other oddball appeared in the stream. Like, you know, when we played a few days ago or whatever. 
And I told him, I'm like, you know, you have to get the sniper. You know, because the boss is hard. <laughs> and I wonder if he made it to the end. Um, because he was playing at the same time. I wonder if he made it to the end without any health. It would be so much easier with health, but I have nothing. So, pure bootleg. Also, I'm shooting in a toddler's room. <laughs> Alright then, ladies and turds. Uh, I'm out of ammo. I had to bootleg the ending. Which is pure turd. I'm gonna use that. Thank you. Alrighty then, here we go. I'm gonna have my katana equipped, of course. And let's beat the game. <laughs> there you go. So yeah, to get the bootleg ending, uh, you have to get rid of all your ammo and then... Did she just die? Or... She's still alive, I don't understand. Wait, does this count as ammo too? No. I don't have any... Yeah, I don't have any um, ammo, so... Wait, what? <laughs> What happened? There have been gamers that have seen the boss die immediately after the fight starts. There have been others who had to run around to heal themselves for a few minutes. Before the game took over and ended the match. Okay. I guess I might have to survive for a while before it, you know, it's like, oh, game over. I don't know. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> You're supposed to end. Why? Why don't you end? Oh, that worked. You know what? I want to do it. I want to beat the boss normally. We tried bootlegging it. It didn't work. I think I think I found a way to dodge the lightning. We're going to do it normally. Here we go. <laughs> I don't want to bootleg it. I want to beat it how you're supposed to. That's why I didn't put save. I think I found a way to get through the lightning. I think we got this, ladies and turds. <laughs> Did you see that? It didn't work. Even the game doesn't want us to finish it. Did you see that? <laughs> Little tear. Um, but yeah, Richard, that's pretty bootleg. I remember a few years ago, we were in, you know, we used to live in this other house. And one time, there was like a crazy, what do you call it? like a crazy storm or something and it knocked out the power for like an entire week or two it was pretty brutal we didn't have a generator or anything you know so all our food I think went bad <laughs> or we had to like eat it quickly or something all right hopefully this works I found a trick uh. oh, I'm not supposed to get hit oh I'm still alive Circle, circle. Okay, I found a trick to fighting the boss. Circle yourself here in this corner. <laughs> circle, circle, circle. Oh my word, it's actually. Oh my lord. It's actually working, ladies and turds. It worked. It worked. We didn't have to bootleg it. 
Oh my word. We didn't have to bootleg it. That was Daddy. Cheryl. Thank you, Daddy. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. We didn't have to bootleg it with the glitch. Oh jeez, that was crazy. Cheryl? <laughs> we didn't have health, so one hit kill and we would have been dead. Be We've been here like for like thirty minutes trying to kill that boss. I tried the glitch, having no ammo, it didn't activate, Cheryl? I know Cheryl? it's not over yet, but still. <laughs> well, I guess it is over. There you go. We should be getting the UFO ending though. Um, is there... Is there a... Uh, we got the good ending. I think it's good ending plus or something. If you get the bad ending, there's another uh, battle, I believe. I think if you get the bad ending, there's another battle. And that's with like the uh, Satan dude, I believe, right? Flying around, I think. Or Incubus or whatever they call him in this game. That was awesome. That was awesome. I'm gonna have to, like I said, I'm gonna make a review on Silent Hill one day. I need to make a pro you know, like a proper video. Cause this is my favorite like horror franchise. And this is the game that got me into the genre. And I, you know, it, it sounds cheesy, but of course it changed, you know, who I am <laughs> for the better, of course. At least I think it did. That was good stuff. I don't remember half the second game, like second uh not game, what am I saying? Half the second uh like the second part of the story, I don't remember most of that at all. You know, like after the whole um, hospital, the entire like section that we just did right now, I don't remember that at all. <sighs> but yeah, we got the UFO ending, or we got the UFO uh, sightings, we got all the weapons, we took out the boss how you're supposed to, with the, rif with the rifle, you saw how easy that was. You just had to dodge a few times, you know. I'm glad we found that trick. The glitch, I couldn't figure out. Like, we tried it, tried emptying our bullets, it didn't work. We had no health, pretty much one hit kill, bootleg. That happened a few times in the game. It was bootleg. Uh, yeah, like I said, I got all the weapons because I played this originally back in 2012, 2013. And so I played it multiple times, got the different endings. And I was able to unlock everything. And so now, if everything worked, I don't know if there's any other like requirements, but if everything works, we should have the UFO ending and we should get the ray gun. I think. Did we get it? 1999. Jesus, that's insane. Konami, please, I'm begging you. Let give us Silent Hill. Give us a port, remaster, something. Is this it? Is this gonna be the also, we saved, um, Sybil. Um, you could have let her die. Carry. Oh my lord. Go. Go. Is this the UFO ending? Come on. Or do I have to do something for it? Like, something different? Did I bootleg something or? Maybe it's after the cutscene? Hi Lisa. Lisa Garland. <clears throat> I'm gonna talk over this just in case uh, it doesn't get bootlegged. Michael Kaufman. Oh. 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 Oh yeah. Oh. Oh, Sybil. That's a weird name. Sybil? Sybil Bennett. Sybil. So yeah, in case you didn't get it, um, our daughter, Cheryl over here, that we found, she's actually Alyssa, I believe? I think, right? That's her? Or am I wrong? <laughs> Thumbs up, dude. No, uh, I, I'm still confused at that. Like. The crazy lady, she had a daughter, right? And sh seven years she left her there to like get tortured and whatever and grow Satan inside her. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Look at that face. Them boobies. <laughs> and then she did, right? Cheryl came back to Silent Hill. 
I guess fulfilled the prophecy or something? That part still kind of confuses me. I'm really happy though that we did that one puzzle, the piano one. Like I was stuck on that for so long. Look at his face. <laughs> Harry Mason. Do we get the UFOs though? UFO ending? Oh, here's our ranking. You. Yeah! What'd I get? Bad. Wait, I got the bad ending? What? Bad plus. Come on now. Oh, that was hard. Okay. Game clear three. Wait, that's only three? No, I swear I played the game more than three times. I got the bad ending. How'd I get the bad ending? What does that mean? <laughs> Continues. Uh, 70. Jesus. I didn't know that counted. Saves 51. Total time almost 9 hours. I walked a lot. I ran a lot. Items. I didn't get every item. That's okay. Defeated enemies by shooting. 14. My rank only 3. Come on. Look at that. Bootleg. 3 stars out of what? 6? I think it's, it's more right. Is it 3 stars out of more? Here. 2 seconds. I'll be right back. I gotta see, how do you get the different, um, hold on. Okay, let's try this again. Ahem. Good ending. To receive the good ending, which is the most practical ending in the game, the player should have an instinct of exploration and discovery, willing to take time to inquire points of interest that aren't necessary to complete the game. I think I did that. It's based on actions the player in the Silent Hill Resort area alone a series of actions must be completed to one of two good endings. Essential requirement, save Kaufman at Annie's bar. Kaufman was the guy who killed the turkey, right? I didn't know he died. Get the motorcycle key in room three at Norman's motel. Wait, I saw... Open the motorcycle's gas tank with a key to see the glass vial inside. Yeah, I didn't even do that. I didn't even see the motorcycle. I remember when I played the first time I saw the motorcycle. Triggering the scene with Kaufman in the garage assures one of the two endings, but does not set in stone which ending you'll get. Um, once that one's been triggered, all that needs to be done is to not save Sybil when fighting her. Oh. Okay, the good ending plus is a variation to the normal good ending. Generally requires the player to be very active, not only in terms of exploration, but also assurance of doing all that's possible. Save Kaufman, get the motorcycle. Save Sybil, I'm guessing. That's so bootleg. The bad ending is the worst possible achievement in the game and there are no requirements do not save Kaufman, do not get the plastic bag. Don't save Kaufman and Sybil. And then bad plus ending, which is this? It is a variation of normal bad ending and the player should generally lack care of searching areas, but I did explore. <laughs> to receive the somewhat happy bad ending, the player is only required to save Sybil in the boss fight. Yeah, bootleg. And the UFO ending is a secret ending that can only be received in the next fear game, which is what we're doing. In order to receive the ending, the player must get the channeling stone. Upon using... Uh, wait, what? Upon using the channeling stone at the top of the lighthouse, after using it in every other area, the game will end there and the UFO ending will play. So we should have got it on top of the roof of the nightmare school. We did that in the courtyard of the nightmare hospital. Just before you fight the boss, we did that inside the motel. We did that inside the boat. We did that at the area on top of the silent hill or on the lighthouse. We did that. Upon using the channeling stone at the top of the lighthouse, after using it in every other area, the game will end right there and the UFO ending will play. What the turd? 
Wait, what? But we did that. Is it okay to save? No. Come on now. Bootleg. I did that, I swear. Maybe you're supposed to do it twice? Like I have proof. I have proof right here. You ready for this? Two seconds. I'll be right back with the proof. Okay, I've returned. Uh, look at this. We did it. And we got bootlegged. You see that? Where am I? There. See that? Watch. Well, you gotta wait a little bit of goals. Gotta, you know, skip through of goals. Here's the lighthouse. I use the channeling stone. Wait for it. Got the channeling stone. And then we got the UFO. And there you go. So is that the UFO ending or was I supposed to use it again after that? I don't understand. Because I used it on the lighthouse and then this happened and it said I'm reading like a thing. You see and then it just goes back to the lighthouse. It says we were supposed to unlock the like the game was supposed to end right there. You know like you don't defeat the uh, boss. Like it just ends. So I'm trying to figure out what happened. <laughs> what the third? What the third happened? Bootleg. Two seconds. We're gonna go see what that what it's supposed to look like then. Hold on. Alright. So I found the video. Let's look at this. I'm gonna press play. Hopefully you can hear it. This is what we did, right? I just showed you right now. I got this cutscene. I have it recorded. I have the highlight. We were on the, you know, lighthouse. I played it. But the UFOs never came down for us, so I don't get it. Like, that's what was supposed to happen, so why didn't it happen? Oh, that's really loud. Why didn't that happen? That's so cheesy. <laughs> and then Harry gets shot. <laughs> of course. Dies. <laughs> Take him away, boys. <laughs> and then they fly away. So yeah, I don't understand. Why didn't that work? Uh, apparently that's a reference to... What is it? War of the Worlds or something? <laughs> Executive producer. And then that's it. It's just the credits. Isn't that bootleg? Like, I don't... <laughs> so yeah, uh, I guess we didn't get the UFO ending. That's so bootleg. Uh, yeah, lighthouse footage I recorded. I have it. Uh, I just played it right before this. I'll play it again after this finishes. This, uh, the ending. Yeah, I saved all... <laughs> this is the cheesiest music ever. I saved all of the... Um, the UFO sightings. I have all five. I have them all though. I think what might have happened is maybe I got it. You know, maybe I got one of them. <laughs> the third. Silent Hill. <laughs> the third is this. <laughs> I think what might have happened is, uh, I think the school bootlegged me. Like getting the first one on the school roof, I think that might have bootlegged me somehow.
because I died there a million times. So I think I got that and then I died and then it didn't save or something. You know what I mean? And so it, maybe it thought we missed the UFO like sighting. I don't know because we died so many times on the roof. And so I forgot to like go back and do it again. So, you know, I guess because I didn't save it, like erased our progress. I don't know. But we should have got it. Like we should have got it. That's pure bootleg. And I didn't make a save. Like I didn't make a, um, what do you call it? Like a, you know, backup or anything. Konami Computer Entertainment Tokyo. The end. <laughs> there you go. That's the UFO ending. Yeah, poop like though, right? And here's what I got. Here you go. Look at that. I might have to play it again on my own if anything. I want to see what that gun does. I mean, I probably will I'll eventually make a video, but look. Watch once it gets to the thing. Look at this bootleg. Oh, is the audio not playing? Oh, geez. Yeah, whatever. So you see that? Look, we got it just like in the video, right? And they're coming down too. And then they fly away. So did I miss something? I think I don't know. Like I said, I have it written, like I have it recorded that we found them all. That's pure bootleg everyone. That's pure bootleg. Um, might as well find out what that gun does then. Laser gun? I don't know what it's called. Hyper blaster. <laughs> you best not be, I swear, better not be a voice or some derpy music or something. I swear to Jesus, don't you do this to me. I swear. I swear. I will mute you. I swear. I just want to see what you do. Bootleg, right? Isn't that bootleg? Darn. Darn. <laughs> Darn. Well, there you go, everyone. That's... Oh, is it going to load or is it going to take 10 years? That's the ending. That's the uh, UFO ending. I guess we got the bad ending. We beat it in nine hours. Oh, my Lord. Nothing's working. Put like this sign of hill for you. Okay, this isn't working, so I can't show you what it looks like. Oh. Is it, is it working? Is it going to load? Or is it going to take 10 years? Oh my god. This is the worst ending ever. <laughs> <laughs> Just work, please. Please. Oh, there we go. Okay. High powered handgun with infrared scope and unlimited ammo. <laughs> what the turd? That's so weird. Look at that. It's got like an actual scope. Oh my word. Wait, did it, he shrink? What happened? Did you see that? What happened to the enemy? Or did they freeze? What the turd? <laughs> I 
I guess they have a heart attack. Instant kill or something. Bootleg. I wonder how that boss, like how that does on the final boss. Look at this, BA. Kills these things in two seconds at the school. I call bootleg. I call bootleg. <laughs> you got the bootleg ending. Yep. Well, there you go. We did our best. That could've, that could've been us. Yeah, that could've been us. Like I said, I might have to play it again just to get that. That's so bootleg. I got them all. Darn. Well, there you go, everyone. That's Silent Hill on the PlayStation 1. The first horror game that got me into the genre. And I think it's my favorite uh, game in the Silent Hill series. I haven't played the anything after 4. But I really like this one. I hope one day, like I said, it gets remade. Or remastered or something. Or ported over to modern consoles so people can play it. Um, Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I had fun. It was a swell time on the stream. Squibbles over here being, you know, Pyramid Head, of course. We got bootlegged. I can't believe we got the bad plus ending, though. I guess we didn't do the motorcycle thing. I thought we did. That's so weird. And yeah, it said we cleared it three times. I think I cleared it more than that. Like, I think I cleared it, like I said, at least, like, five or six times. I think I just didn't play it on, um, new, what do you call it, new, what's the word, new fear mode, but yeah, that's it, thanks for watching, that's Silent Hill, <laughs> bootleg, I really wanted that UFO ending, and that weapon, turd, <laughs> not watching Natural Libre, <laughs> Bootleg. Adios. Until next time.